What's good guys, welcome back to the channel. Today is Sunday, March 17th and I'm about to go for a coffee walk with my girlfriend as we often do on Sundays. But before, I want to bring you guys back with me to New York. New York is a place where I've been a couple times now and last year I've visited the city for two times and even for a third time in December. On the 21st of December, my girlfriend and I, we departed Frankfurt and arrived on the 21st um, in New York City. And we spent one and a half, let's say two days in the city. Um, just to make this clear, um, my girlfriend works as a flight attendant, so she was able to bring me with her all the way without paying too much money. So this is how I ended up in New York City right before Christmas. And we both were very excited to see how the city looks like during the Christmas time. So in this video, it is just a very short, like two day trip to New York City, which sounds a little rad if you come from Europe, but this is what we did. All the photos were taken on my Leica Z2X, my trusty point and shoot zoom camera from Leica. It just gives me a little more like flexibility. It is of course not so fast. It starts at F4 and goes up to F7.6. So it's not super sensitive to light, but still, um, I found it quite nice to have some like motion blur when you just like snap around and zoom in all the way. Uh, you end up with some very nice results. You will pretty much see that in this video, but also in the upcoming videos from Cape Town and from the Dominican Republic, where I shot some lovely photographs. So without further ado, I'll leave you guys along with this video now. I'm gonna catch coffee with my girlfriend and I hope you enjoyed this short two day trip video from New York City during the Christmas time. Oh, and just one more thing guys, as I'm cutting the video right now, I just recognized one specific topic that I was taking photos of. I'm taking a lot of photographs of these traffic cones. So in Germany they're called pylonen or like a thing in English that might be called pylons or whatever. So these like traffic cone things, the red, orange uh, traffic cones, you see it on the streets a lot of times and I found it super funny to look at how the different nations and different countries make use of these like traffic cones. And especially in New York, I found that they are used in a super ridiculous way sometimes and you will see it in the video. So I might make a fun project out of this, but it's for sure something that I'm paying more and more attention to when I walk the streets. Um, you can judge yourself if you like the photos, but I found it super funny to look at these things. Maybe you can also look uh, out for how these things are used in, in the streets by yourself, because it is absolutely ridiculous. Back to the video now.
So that wraps up the video guys. Thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you guys had a nice Sunday. I hope you guys got something out of this video. If you have any further questions from my trips to New York, where I go mostly, what kind of cafes I like, um, what is my go-to photo spots or like parts of the city where I go to frequently. I'm of course not super experienced uh, compared to anyone who lives in New York, but um, I've been to the city quite some time now and, and I love coming back every single time. Uh, it's a very special place. Um, I love spending time there, I love taking photographs there. So if you have any questions, feel free to comment down below. If you have any further questions on anything else photography related or just personal things you want me to share, please also leave that down below. I'm very grateful for you guys watching this. Hope you got some value out of this video and see you in the next one.